the freshmen. Uh, this is their first real action, actually, you know, meaningful action. I mean, do you say anything to them to advice, or do you just kind of let the team handle that and let themselves kind of go through that process? Yeah, you know, we played, you know, we scrimmaged with Wichita State. You know, they were, they were good. I thought Quincy did a really good job. So, you know, you have one scrimmage, you have one sort of dress rehearsal. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to make a big thing of it. We take a pretty business-like approach. You know, I'm not sure they can move on the upper class, but they need to. You went with kind of like the hockey line change sort of substitutions in the exhibition. Is that something you plan on doing, or is that just kind of, you know, in the I mean, exhibition? I'll typically put a couple guys in first, and but I mean, if I'm going to play 10, they're going to get in there anyway. They're going to get in there eventually. And I'm not... I said I wouldn't play more than 10 because I feel comfortable with the next two or three guys as well. How has DeSante looked? Obviously he's in the starting lineup, but how has he looked so far over the he, He's been really good. I mean, he's he plays both ends. He's creative. He gets to the rim. But, he, you know, he's going to really compete. And uh, he's moving the ball well. You know, that's like I said before, I mean, that's a tough one because, you know, I think Josh Dix is right there. And, Played extremely well, you know, and so have the you know the two freshman guards. Uh, what's uh, North Dakota like? What do you know? Well, they're you know they got like five guys back. They're really good players, and they've got a couple of junior college transfers, and they got a really good freshman class deep. Uh, so they're they're pretty big, but they also have you know a number of three point shooters. I've been really impressed with, with what I've seen from them on film. I've seen a lot of them from, from this year, but uh, you know, like I said, they got five guys back, so. Brock kind of strikes me as a guy that really is the next play mentality, doesn't seem to linger on the stakes and plays with really, really good pace. Is that just sort of what you've seen kind of throughout the summer and leading up the season? Yeah, that's kind of how he's always been. He just he just plays, he, he doesn't get too high or too low. He's, he's you know, always gonna be, an attack guy, which is what